Why was this portrait made soon after this woman expired? This is Giovanna delle Albizzi Tornaboni, a Florentine noblewoman born in 1486. She married her husband, 20-year-old Lorenzo Tornaboni, at the age of 17 in 1486. Lorenzo was part of the prominent Tornaboni family that was related to the Medicis, and Lorenzo the Magnificent himself helped bring the couple together. They were married in a lavish wedding where she had about a hundred young Florentine women from well-to-do families walking behind her as she made her way to the cathedral in Florence. And there were festivities that included banquets and dances. In 1488, she died while giving birth to their second child. Both she and the child passed, leaving her husband grief-stricken and heartbroken. Lorenzo commissioned this painting in order to honor his wife's memory and to keep her inner and outer beauty alive for years to come. Although the painting was made after her death, she may have previously sat for Ghirlandaio, where he was able to have sketches made for her. She's depicted wearing a gold brocade giornea that includes a Tornaboni emblem as well as two L's for her husband Lorenzo. Giovanna is also wearing a gold pendant with a single ruby and three pearls held by a thin cord. And behind her, you see a similar piece of jewelry, a dragon pendant with a large ruby set in gold with two pearls and three gemstones surrounding it. This is a reference to St. Margaret, the patron saint of childbirth. There's also coral prayer beads, which may symbolize the well-being and health of a newborn child, and a prayer book just below. There's also this small note with an inscription that reads, if only art could reproduce the character and spirit. In all the world, a more beautiful painting will never be found. 1488. Lorenzo wanted to make sure that the character and virtues of his wife were showcased through symbolism and the imagery in the portrait. He kept this portrait in a room near his private chamber that had walls and ceilings gilded in gold. A similar image of Giovanna is found in the frescoes of the Tornaboni Chapel at Santa Maria Novella, where she is buried. However, this time it's a full figure. Let me know your thoughts on this portrait of Giovanna.